In today's video, I'll be showing you the most powerful features and the best way to write any type of article you're looking for when using ChatGPT. I would recommend getting the $20 per month plan. I think it's well worth the money that you pay because you get access to a lot of different features and you get access to the best models and all of the features included in ChatGPT. Most recent model is ChatGPT 03. And I wanted to do a quick test to see if ChatGPT's O3 can actually bypass AI detectors. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna tell it to write an article. I've already given it my prompts, which is my low AI prompts. I'll leave a link for those prompts in the description below. But essentially this is tells AI to write in, in a more human-like manner to possibly bypass AI detectors. The prompt was I told it to write an article on how to run meta ads in 2025, aim for 3000 words, include list tables, charts, and write following the instructions above. The cool thing with ChatGPT now is that it's getting really, really smart. You don't have to give it long prompts and make sure that your prompt is amazing for it to give you good outputs. It's becoming so intelligent that you can give it very simple prompts and it's able to follow those instructions to a T. So one of the biggest improvements that I've seen is within word count. Before, if I told to write a 2000 word article, I'd be lucky if I got you know a thousand words. Now, when I tell it to write 3000 words, I sometimes get even more than 3,000 words. So that is one of the biggest improvements that I've seen. And look at how quick this was, right? It wrote that article very, very quickly. It included some nice checklists. It included some, um, some HTML element. It included your FAQs. Let's actually go ahead and see how long this was. And we actually get some additional resources. So it's about 2,600 words, and I would say minus the table of contents, it's probably around like you know 2,400 words. Again, not bad for any means. One shot, it took us literally about, what, 15 seconds to write a 2,000 word article. So it's much, much quicker to do so. And if we actually went ahead and, you know, this was a prompt to write in a specific way, but if you told us to write longer, I'm sure we can definitely get longer content. I'm gonna scan this on originality.ai. We're gonna check for AI content plagiarism, readability, and grammar, and we'll see what the score is. Now, while that's being checked, I wanna show you guys some cool features included on ChatGPT that you may have forgot or don't regularly use, but it's actually really useful. Number one is if you head over to your profile, you can customize your ChatGPT. You can tell it things such as what should it call you, what do you do, but the most important ones are what traits should ChatGPT have? So when writing content, you can tell it what traits should it have, how should it write, and anything else ChatGPT should know about you. And this actually allows ChatGPT to tailor its output towards you. So if you're a business, you can say, this is my business, this is what we do, this is the traits that, of what we, um, our brand voice or brand image, and this is how you should write when writing about our company. And then that would enable ChatGPT to, to have all that information and to feed you more customizable outputs based upon your specific business or your specific niche. And it's very, very useful and it works really, really well. One of the other latest rollouts from ChatGPT is the ability to use the search feature within O3 Mini. So you can actually search the web while using one of the latest models. And again, I think that this is because of DeepSeek and increasing competition and ChatGPT just kind of released all of, feature, all of his features that it had sort of waiting um, so it's kind of forced to do so, but it's really good for us because we can get to use all of these. And I'll show you guys how I used this feature yesterday. So what I did was I told it to, I want you to find the best relevant mortgage news for the past two days in Toronto. And I want you to write on your own unique topic that you found with your own unique opinions. And it was able to search the web. It found a really good topic. It took some information, but then it wrote its own unique article. As you can see here, we got all of the sources within that article. And this article was, I think, close to 2000 words. It's very in-depth, very well formatted, very opinionated, very valuable. And it took me literally less than five minutes to do so. And then what I did was I told it to then write a second article within that same interface. And it was able to write another article for me that's up to date, that's trendy, and that's fresh. So that is a really, really powerful feature. Again, you can use the all through mini and use the search feature and it can write really good articles. So just to confirm, you can use the O3 Mini and the O3 Mini High and the search feature enabled. So again, you get the access to one of the highest models with the ability to search the web. Very, very powerful combination. Now let's go back and take a look at our AI score. It is 100% likely AI, that's okay. I don't really worry about AI content score, but I just wanted to test it out to see what it's like. 49 readability score, which is pretty decent. 98% correct and a 7% plagiarism checker. That's a little bit high for my likings. I'd probably want to reduce that. 
But overall, those are some of the newest and most powerful features from ChatGPT. I think for the $20 per month that you pay, you get a lot in return and you can do all of your content writing in one place. Hope that you guys enjoyed today's video. If you did, let it be known by giving us a big thumbs up and I'll see you in the next video. Take care.